Explosivity. Tac, 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 tac. Hi guys, I'm Richard Amaker and today we're gonna speak about skiing with style. Style is really important to me because you're like an artist or like a dancer and you want to perform on the slope. If you are working on your style, you will get a lot more fun. And now let's get to my top tips. My first tip is don't be boring and skiing. That's the most important, not doing always the same turns. So try to switch it up. So you've got, the, you've got the normal turns, like we all know, short turns, middle turns, carving turns. But now I will show you other turns like Swedish turns, holly, holly turns, like some bobsleigh turns. And yeah, let's experiment this. Not too fast. And now I'm gonna start with Holly turns and then Swedish turns and now bobsleigh turns. That's really fun. And then some inside ski. And that's a lot of fun. It's different and fun. <laughs> If you can do a lot of variation, you will improve your skiing and that's also really important. And if you can do a lot of variation, you will find your style too. And that's awesome. All right, my next step is use the terrain with the bumps, moguls, steep terrain, middle terrain, flat terrain. You can play all the way down. Here we are on the flat terrain but we can still work with them and play with them. And that's awesome, you know? And when you can do combinations, switch skiing, slop tricks. When I'm looking at the mountain, the first thing is, okay, try to read the terrain. Okay, now we're gonna speak a little bit about the snow too, because we can have a, a lot of fun in different snow. Potted, potted snow, hard pack snow, slushy snow. And now I'm gonna do a little spray. Woo and that's really important, having fun with also different kind of snow. Maybe it's not the best technique, but it's the best fun you can have. And you know what? The mountains are the biggest playground in the world. So play with this. Tip number three, getting explosivity with your movements. So to me, to be explosive, you need to work with your legs because a lot of people are just standing like this without using the legs. They are getting a little bit lazy, try to save some energy. So they don't, don't bend knees anymore. As always, I said, Skiing is a sport, so if you want to do some sport, you need to work with your legs. So now I will show you how the people sometimes getting lazy when skiing. And then I will show you how to get more explosive. So now it's like, yeah, I'm cruising around, easy, I'm not bending my knees. And now I will show you how it works. Tack! Tack! Yes, and this is explosive, and this is cool, and this is fun. And now explosive also, back. Two. Some switch, tack, bending, hop, down, hop, down, hop, down, hop, down. And this is really explosive. And this is, you can work on your style like this. You have much more possibilities than just like crossing around. It's a style too, but yeah, you will get bored skiing like this, I think. So try to be original.
it's really simple to me to say, okay, lazy, explosive. I have a lot of experience. I'm skiing every day, so this is my job. But what's really important is getting out this lazy mindset. So of course it's not gonna be happen on one day skiing, but you need to build this explosivity. You need to build your amplitude of moments. You need to build the, the, the bending your knees and it's coming slowly, slowly. But what is really important, think about, okay, I want to go there having fun and doing some sport. And that's the most important. You will feel directly the difference between laziness and action. Last tips, fluidity. Find your flow. It's like the same on the Saturday night when you're going on the, on the dance floor, you have some music, you try to find the rhythm. Skiing is exactly the same. Find the rhythm, find the flow. We have the terrain, we have the variation, and this is our music. Don't force it. Find the flow, try to release, try to relax. For an average skier, if you force your skiing, no worries. Just try to, to maybe going back to the basics, technique, or also to a easier terrain, and then trying on those terrain to find the flow before going back to the steeper terrain and then you will find your flow and that's the goal for skiing with Thai. Okay guys, I hope you enjoy the lesson. We see my four tips, variations, using the trains, explosivity and of course creativity, fluidity and that's the most important, getting your own style and that's really important, your own style make your signature and when you have your signature then you can have a lot of fun on skis yeah if you like the lesson just leave a comment and uh, if you want to have more content subscribe and now get back on your skis have fun and see you later bye in french actually we're saying fart i don't know if it's that uh, we can use this in english but yeah relax easy Get relaxed, get into your flow, and yeah, like a dancer, tack and bam!